Hi, this is Lisa from Skyp Art Center, and welcome back to another video. In this video, we'll be learning how to make a simple notebook or sketchbook using just paper and an elastic band. For supplies, you'll need 5 to 7 sheets of paper, colored paper for the cover, an elastic band, scissors, pencil, and a ruler. The size of your book will be determined by the size of your elastic and how much it can stretch. Smaller elastic bands will make smaller books, and bigger elastic bands will make bigger books. Start with stacking 5 to 7 pieces of paper on top of each other. I find that 5 to 7 pieces of paper is easiest to cut through with scissors. Then fold your paper in half. By folding the paper, you'll end up with twice the amount of pages. If you start with 5 pieces of paper, you'll end up with 10 pages in your book. Next, do the same with the cover paper. You can use whatever colors you like, and you can even decorate it at the end. Next, I'm going to trim down the inner pages and make it slightly smaller than my cover page. This way, when we put everything together, the inner pages won't be seen on the outside. I'm going to use a pencil to make a mark where I want to cut, and you can either use scissors or a paper cutter which I'm using here. Place the inner pages into the cover to make sure everything is the right size and fits snugly. Next, we're going to make two rectangular notches on the top and bottom. To cut the notch, hold all the pages together with one hand, and with the other hand, use scissors to cut two little slits with a space in between. Next, I'm going to turn the book around to make it easier to cut. I'm going to go through one of the small slits and then turn my scissors to the side to cut out the middle. Do the same for the other side, and when you're done, you can place your elastic band in between the notches. This will hold all the pages together. They make great little books for sketching, to-do lists, and notes. Silvana from Skype Art Center had the great idea of turning old greeting cards into books as well, using ribbon instead of an elastic band. We hope you liked this video and thank you so much for watching. As always, the written instructions will be linked in the description box below. Take care and we'll see you in the next video.